at 150 calories this is 150 calories and that's just to show you that all calories are not created welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new this is Larice lifestyle and I am Larice if you're into natural hair care health and fitness if you want to learn all my tricks and trade into growing natural hair and losing weight and keeping it off go ahead and subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you won't miss another video from me today I'm going to be showing you the snacks I used to eat before I start my intermittent fasting and the snacks I trade those old snacks for the new one I'm gonna compare the calories count in them and the sugar you're gonna be amazed of what I eat when we don't read the label you're gonna to want to start reading the label of all your snacks after this video so stay tuned watch this video to the end you don't want to miss all these calories and sugars that you're eating without knowing it so these used to be some of my favorite snack before I start intermittent fasting I would eat these not necessarily every day but at least one or twice a day some form of this now these are my favorite snack and intermittent fasting. I have my berries, I have my carrots, my mango. Gotta be careful with that, it's a lot of sugar. My apple, my pear, my oranges. I make a complete switch for healthier snacks because I want to lose the weight and keep it on. I wanna be healthy. So I'm just gonna go through this and show you the different calories in in the serving so this was one of my all-time favorite snack I'll have that three four times a week now I cut back to probably once or twice a month because again I'm watching my calories intakes and this is 210 calories so I can't afford to have such a tiny snack given up 210 calories if I'm trying to lose this is a hundred gram of blueberries that's what a hundred gram of blueberry looks like in a hundred grams of blueberry you have 57 calories all of that is 57 calories it's only 14 grams of carbs it has fibers in there and a lot of vitamin C and B And I'm just going to pour it on the plate just so you have an idea. It's not a, a whole lot, but for a snack, that's a good amount. So I just want to pour it in there so you can have an idea of what we're working with. So that's a good snack for only 57 calories. This was one of my go-to snacks, especially around my cycle. Ladies, you know that one snack you can't do without um, when you're close to your cycle. I love coconut and I love almond and they put this together and I couldn't have enough of this snack. But since I start intermittent fasting, I kind of slow back on this. I don't eat it as much because it's 220 calories. As good as it is, I just can't do it so once or twice for the month that's as much as I'll eat this one now there's another eye fiber snack that I'm loving right now these are the pears and in the pear it says a medium pear which I think that's a small one but it says a medium pear is about a hundred calories it have 5.5 grams of fibers that's good five that's a good fiber and the sugar in it is natural nothing to be concerned with unless you're diabetic then you want to not have too much of these but a hundred and one calories and you're gonna stay full longer anything that have fiber is gonna keep you full longer I know I keep repeating that because it's important you want to eat things that's gonna you're gonna stay full longer 
you're not going to eat it and two minutes later you want another snack that's pointless if you're trying to a lose large weight. orange and i just google a large orange it said it's 80 calories 87 calories in one large orange do you know in this one orange alone you have more than the daily recommended vitamin c yes this orange alone one large orange is more than the daily recommended vitamin c and it have a lot of fibers fiber is your friend if you're trying to lose weight if you take a large intake of fiber and you drink a lot of water or even just the recommended amount of water you're going to find out that you're going to go to the bathroom with no ease it's it's a very good it's healthy it's sweet i know the sugar content in fruits are a little higher than vegetables but those are natural sugar and your body tend to burn those and break down them differently from sugar that's added to things so again 85 calories very good so i went ahead and i opened my bag of chips but before i just want to show you one bag of chips 150 calories i open it and i pour it in here so you have a better idea but you know what a bag of chips looks like i'm just going to pour it out so you see how much there's nothing in the bottom that's it that is one bag of chips i have there just kind of put it back in here i don't eat these anymore so i'm that's why i'm Looks like I'm playing around with it. I'm just going to pour that in the trash. I did start with a clean and but that's that's 150 calories right there. So if especially if you're watching your calories, that's 150 calories worth of chips. Whereas this is 150 calories worth of carrots. And um one let me just go ahead and show you here. I did rip this kind of bad. So this is five servings at 30 calories per serving. So you just multiply the amount by that. If I eat this, I'm hungry. That's It is what it is, a snack, something in between meal. I'm hungry in no time. I can honestly tell you I cannot sit and eat the same 150 calories. But I'm going to pour it out so you see. That's an entire bag of baby carrots right there. So there we go. So that's it. Oh, that's 150 calories of carrots. Now, if I eat this and I eat this and I'm getting the same amount of calories, obviously, I'm going to eat way less of this and if I eat this, I'm eat. I'm gonna need way more to fall to be full. Basically, is what I'm saying. So that's 150 calories. This is 150 calories, and that's just to show you that all calories are not created equally. So you need to choose your snacks. You need to be sure of what you're eating. You need to read the label. I did not get into labor reading until late when I took in college I took a nutritional class and I'm like really one bottle of soda is 2.5 servings so I'm not so this is not 200 calories in this I have to multiply that by 2.5 so it gets really confusing the label if you if you don't know what you're doing but once you get into it you don't have to go around weighing everything because you'll have a good judgment and what you're doing so that's just i just want to go and show you so i'm going to compare another one of my favorite snack which when i compare it i'm like there is no way no way and so i i didn't completely stop eating these things i do eat them but i very careful of when and how i eat them so instead of reaching for a bag of chips 50 calories i'll probably eat less than half of this i'm full longer because there's a lot of fiber in this and fiber is going to keep you full longer and the truth when i eat this you're sluggish you just you know you're tired you're you want more basically food like this makes you crave more so you reach for another bag and another bag when you eat this you feel full longer you don't have that craving for more and it's it's 
it's just better overall so here again i showed you that earlier so this is 140 calories one bag 140 calories and this is what come in that snack for 140 calories if you remember earlier the one from the carrots how much 150 is i understand that that's 10 different calories but the volume it doesn't it doesn't do much and again there is the package 140 calories that's what 140 calories of some of our favorite chips look like and again i'm not bashing chips i'm not bashing any of these snacks i love some of these snacks but instead of having it every day or eating two three bags a week i'm down to probably one a month if that much these are things that I love. These are things that I will love for the rest of my life. I just won't indulge in it as much as I used to. Those are some of my favorite snacks. Some of my old favorite snacks that I still enjoy. I had some new favorite snacks that are delicious that I just wasn't enjoying as much as I should. I'm losing the weight. I'm keeping it off. I'm not depriving myself of my favorite snacks. Because, like I said, it's just moderation. You use, you eat your favorite snacks, but you cut back on the amount you usually have. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and press the subscription button below. Turn on the bell notification so you won't miss another video from me. Have a wonderful week. See you next week. Bye.